Hey, Sangrias here from the Hidden Levels. This is a 100% achievement guide walkthrough for Goosebumps the game for Xbox. Uh, this was recorded on Xbox 360, but it works for all the versions of the game to get all the achievements. Uh, you actually require two playthroughs. This first playthrough will be break down, broken down into about three parts, about 20 minutes each. <coughs> so. This will be the longer playthrough and what I'm going for is mainly to die 10 different ways and to get all the available items in the game. The reason you need another playthrough is because there is a uh, achievement for beating the game uh, while uh, doing only 175 moves and you really can't do that if you're going for uh, trying to get everything uh, available in the game because there are so many extra items that's not really needed so like uh, open up the locker get the um, cell phone and the uh, paper on the floor uh, getting the cell phone gets you the uh, collect the locker from the uh, cell phone collect the cell phone from the locker achievement uh, go Go towards the parking lot and then towards the janitor's chat on the right. I'm using the um, D-pad to go make the uh, movements. So you hold down the D-pad down, right, left, up uh, to go to the direction that I'm uh, using. Uh, and the arrow fills up so you can tell. Uh, don't forget to pick up that dog flyer. <coughs> I'm going to try and uh, point out the items that's not really required for the main story. Here is the first death. Instead of killing this guy, uh, try moving left or right and you will get killed. So hit retry. Go back to that area. <clears throat> and use the weed killer on the man to kill him. I believe this is an achievement. There is an achievement associated to killing him, I think. If I remember correctly. Yeah, stay out of the forest. So you got that achievement. Move left, move right, go right again towards the van, pick up the three items that I pick up, which is the shrunk head, the uh, top hat, and the book. The only item you really need is the shrunken head, and even that can be avoided if you get the hunted mask. Uh, get, pick up the blue rose from the uh, garden. <coughs> Uh, here you have to be careful. This is a completely missable achievement if you don't do it right here This is the only time where the, this rabbit appears put the hat on the rabbit and you get an achievement for this It's called good hair day and then uh, jump into that hole. That's your second death here Hit retry and then we'll go forward again. There is an achievement for throwing down 10 items into that hole, but we don't have 10 items and you can't throw, throw away uh, essential items like the uh, cell phones, so you have to be careful. Uh, pick, you, you have to do it later. Uh, pick up the old shoe and then move up again. Uh, open up that mailbox, uh, pick up the letter and the coupon. Coupon is not a necessary item. <clears throat> go upwards towards the backyard pick up the dino the truck and the spade look in the hole on the right side shake the can and pick up the key underneath it the door on the right is locked that's uh that takes you to the uh, laundry room in the house you you can open it later but you never have to come back to this area so that's not really needed now go right and open Open the door to the house. This is your house, <clears throat> and this is an achievement for getting back to your house. Welcome to that house. All right, drink that prune juice. Don't don't do don't. You don't have to pick it up yet. You're gonna die anyway. Drink that prune juice. That's your third death. There's about 17 ways to die. You only need 10 different ways. I do miss a couple, but I'll point out that it's possible to die there okay and these three children up here uh, there is an achievement for helping all these all three children before they disappear on their own so uh, follow my guide 
use the letter on the left guy left kid and he'll drop a uh, photo paper so pick that up actually I don't think I pick it up here yet go down to the basement uh, search the toolbox actually miss a portrait down on the left and I'll come back for it but if you want to pick it up now you can save a little bit of time you can do that <clears throat> it's on the down left on that uh, table or chair whatever that is open up that door using the uh, turn and then enter it pick up the film on the down right side there and then go back out you have to enter this area from four different angles uh, for an achievement pick up the photo paper that I mentioned before go upwards you have to kill this lady for an achievement but if you kill her now uh, you can't get the um, photo of seven deadly monsters you have to get uh, photos of all the monsters then you get the camera a little bit later uh, you pick up pick up all the items that I picked up and then open up go to the kitchen open up the fridge get these two items open up the pantry get that uh, purple peanut butter open up the drawer get the talisman this is the only required item in this area uh, get these two uh, items dish soap and sponge uh, use the screwdriver that you found in the basement to open up the screw you don't have to do this now uh, you're gonna enter this area I'm gonna enter this area in a little, little bit later you you can enter it now if you feel like it doesn't really matter it um, doesn't make any difference use the wire hanger on the sink the garbage disposal to get the study key <coughs> go down uh, and then into the uh, living room area Get the TV remote on the desk. Uh, get the film on the on the bookshelves there, and check the bookshelf for a book on horses. And then uh, go. To, I think I go towards the laundry now. Yeah. Um, that's the door I mentioned that at leads to the backyard on the middle of the screen there. So you don't have to open it if you feel like to open it open up that door that I'm pointing at right now and enter it for the second entrance to the elevator to nowhere go back out and I believe that's all yeah make sure to pick up the stuff on the right side uh, we have to come back to this area quite often for another um, achievement and uh, uh, trying to get all the items this that is this is one of the more annoying items to get okay um, I forgot to help the uh, little girl as well as I missed the portrait so I come back for the portrait first and then I'll help the girl uh, by the way part one ends after uh, helping that uh, middle boy there are two ways to help the boy and I'll tell you both but I'll be doing the one that get you the achievement um, it came from the internet if you do it the other way you you will get one of the achievement which is to help all three kids but you will not get the it came from the internet so um, it's probably better to do it the way I do in the video so you, you save a playthrough uh, get rid of the 1988 tab and that gets rid of the girl so there's only one person left and uh, getting rid of the girl is important for opening up the doors upstairs okay, go left to your bedroom uh, open up the drawer uh, pick up the clothes first open up the drawer in the nightstand pick up the games and then uh, that's it go to the bathroom open up the cupboard open up the drawer there's a shoot uh, laundry shoot under that cupboard pick up the hand mirror um, use the sink this is for the um, it came from the internet achievement so use the sink use the uh, faucet in the shower that uh, like makes uh, hot air appear in the mirror look in the mirror for the uh, password to the PC <coughs> And then throw down anything other than clothes. 
like uh, the games that I do this is this doesn't matter which one you do throw down you, as long as you throw something down open up the drawer uh, get the film in there open up the door on the back side there for the uh, third entrance to the <clears throat> elevator to nowhere the fourth entrance in the master bedroom you can only get there after helping the third kid so I actually exited out of the wrong area I needed to go back to the toy area actually I went I went to the laundry straight away using the shortcut uh, exact lunch after you drop something down the chute if you search the basket um, ma the first time the mask appears uh, after that if you throw something down uh, a random item appears and there's five of them five ram five different ones so you have to get all five of them and that's the most co annoying part for this walkthrough uh, put the clothes in that washer uh, and put some detergent in close the washer and then use it for an achievement for uh, starting a chore a shocker a shock street so your mom will probably be shocked that you, that you did you did the laundry on your own so go downwards to the living room area go down again okay we'll go to the kitchen and we are going to go into the area that I talked about uh, under the sink go into the cross space in this one uh, I get really lucky <laughs> I find the way on the first try uh, so just follow what I the rule I think this is not random uh, it says to listen for a drip and it gives you hints like only if I can make the drip drip sound longer or louder or something I don't really know how to do that but I got really lucky so just follow uh, the way I take and that's the right way <coughs> I don't I, I don't ever get into a dead end uh, but complete luck I think anyway uh, taste that green slime thing for a death so this is your fourth death retry uh, pick up the bag and that's like get you two items which is a chest piece and a key and the slimes up here so go back first and then go towards the slime for your fifth death tasting and getting uh, gooped by the slime is a different uh, different death so that's five out of ten already uh, the game's about one third over if this is your first time playing it and there's 17 deaths so that's about right Okay, now we're gonna run away. Just keep going back. Go back about seven times. Go down, go press down, and just keep going back. You don't have to go left, right, or whatever. Just keep going down. That's all you have to do to get back to the kitchen. And uh, escaping from whatever is beneath the sink is another achievement. Okay, so almost there. I think one more or two more. Yeah, we are nearly there. Just a couple more. There we go. Okay, that's an achievement for escaping that. It came from beneath the sink. Now I'll go down. We got the key to the dark room, so we're gonna go back to where the laundry is. And the door on the left side, that's the dark room, so we're gonna use that surfboard key. <clears throat> and slap is suddenly appears. That's the end boss. So we'll open up this area. I'm not gonna speed up the next part of the video or anything, but um, you may need to. You may want to take out your smartphone, um, a watch or whatever, because you need to kind of time this. First of all, pick up the tongs. Pick up that photo on the on the right side open up the cupboard pick up the camera this is very important pick up the container now use the tongs on the f oh, okay fill the sink first use the tongs on the photo paper get your stopwatch or uh, countdown timer ready for one minute okay put 
put that in there and wait one minute get ready to use the tongue after a minute we'll move it to the second top and then one minute later we'll move it to the third top and then one minute later we'll move it to sink and then after that um, take it out of the sink put it on the clothespin all the way on the right side so fifth from the left or the first from the right and then uh, wait uh, hit uh, the photo a couple times to wait then uh, pick up that photo and put that photo in the portrait uh, this is needed for helping the uh, second kid there are two ways to help the second kid which is to he wants to listen to this music that is on a cassette tape um, that is owned by the old lady that you can only get after killing the old lady and the two ways to uh, make him listen to that is to finish get three chess pieces to finish the um, chess piece puzzle in your room um, to get the uh, cassette player and then uh, in the toy box room there is going to be a robot that you kill and you can get the uh, batteries from there so put the batteries in the cassette player open the cassette player and put the cassette in there and give it to the kid that's one way this does not give you an achievement this is this method is not required at all uh, the other method is to uh, get the study key uh, for using the wire hanger in the sink in the kitchen open up the study door which is on the across from your room closer to the screen and then um, go to the bathroom use the uh, sink faucet and the shower faucet to make the hot water steam and uh, get the mirror to show the password and then go back to the study use the PC uh, this assumes you already have the cassette uh, click music on the PC and then uh, use the cassette on the search button to search for that music and download it to your phone and then uh, have the kid listen to it from the phone and that's another achievement uh, by the way I'm also going for not using the phone to uh, for in this achievement and also making the phone drain to 0% in this walkthrough so don't ever charge your phone and don't ever use the phone to call someone. Uh, using the phone to uh, make him listen to the music that's not considered um, part of using the phone you know, because you didn't call anyone. So that's fine. So don't worry about it. You can. That's the only time we're gonna use the cell phone. So another minute passes and we take that out, we're almost done. And then we'll put that in the sink. This time, it actually is five minutes, but the game like just passes it over. It says, wait, 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 da, 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 and that's five minutes. So you don't have to actually wait in real time. Uh, if you, by the way, if you make a mistake, you have to start over from the beginning. So just make sure you are waiting the one minute. It has to be real time one minute. There is no indicator like um, if you examine the photo or anything. It doesn't really tell you. You have to hit that button to wait uh, for the photo to dry out, and then use it in the portrait. And we'll be using this um, outside somewhere to get a chess piece. So now let's go kill that bitch, the elderly lady, because we need that cassette. Alright, there are several ways to make her go to sleep, but first of all, let's take a picture. Okay, that's the first deadly monster picture. Stay no way. Apologize and decline yet if you drink you die remember that give details you have to take this for an achievement change the subject keep talking continue and let her sleep 
That's this is the only way to get the achievement. Uh, she'll go to sleep if you go the other way. Use the purple stuff on the glass. If you go somewhere else and come back, she does wake up. So unless if you didn't kill her yet, you can get that achievement anytime. But okay, she's dead. I'll pick up the cassette. I believe this is an achievement. Yeah, there we go. An old story's end. I'll go down. Okay, so we have the first part that we need to help that little kid. Go upstairs to the railing area. I think I used the portrait here. Okay, maybe not. Okay, now we already got the password, so we're gonna use the study key to open up the door. Go in there. Uh, use the piece uh, you pick up the chest piece and then use the PC I already told you how to do this music <coughs> use the cassette on the search button and then click download and then back back up again. There is a film on the right side if you want to pick it up. I guess I go back for it later. Okay, actually, I think I go back for it now because I realized I missed it. Okay, pick that up. That's all. The, you don't have to come into this area anymore. Go, go downstairs. Actually, no. Let, I guess I go to the uh, this area first. Okay, I don't know how to die to this robot, but there is a way to die. I don't die here. I forget to do this. Uh, uh, this is considered a death. So if you want the death achievement as quickly as possible, uh, do that. Uh, use the camera on, on him first and then use the dish soap uh, that kills him. Use the screwdriver on the back of that toy. And take out the batteries. And that's it for this part of this room. There's nothing more to be done in this room. Go back out. Uh, by the way, the hunter mask, if you put it on and keep it on for like three minutes, that's another death. So if you want uh, if you want quick death as quickly as possible, that's something to do. Go back down, and we're gonna help the kid by using the cell phone, and that's the end of part one. We're gonna pick up right here, but I wanna show you getting the achievements, so I go a little bit more. My name is Sangrias, this is part one of the uh, Goosebumps, the game walkthrough for 100% of all the achievements. This will be a four part video, so thanks for watching part one, and I'll be back with part two. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I'll see you in a little bit.